I should probably make this video. Um, I am doing my day off from the detox baths. Uh, I don't get any day offs on the internal detox. That happens multiple times a day, actually. But the baths I can only do every other day because they're intense. Anyway, um, I have started using borax and palm olive or castor oil and like scrubbing areas on my face that have that gray cast on it. Sorry, I can't see anything. And it works way faster than the bath. So if you have a certain area on your skin or a certain part of your body where you you notice more intensity, try this technique. It, it looks rather terrifying, but it actually works really well. And it's gotten rid of age spots, wrinkles, um, a lot of the graphene crap that's embedded into my skin. So borax, and you can use really any sort of emollient. Um, if you don't like castor oil, let me just tell you that um, this whole process is meant to dry your skin out. And I'm the type of, I should turn the water off, jeez. I'm the type of person who used to use like insane amounts of moisturizers. I don't like having dry skin. And so I was trying to find something that would not like be bad for this process that would work in tandem with this process. And castor oil is freaking amazing. I may make a, a whole video about it. Um, once I get done with the baths, I use the castor oil. But when my face skin is really dry... Oh, and the other thing I use is sulfur soap. Sorry, I'm like, I, I have not even finished coffee. Um, borax plus palm olive, like sugar scrub type scrub. I don't I guess it's just called a scrub. Uh, sulfur soap and borax, very intense, but it, it, it will get this stuff off. It just takes a while. And then when your skin is super dried out, try castor oil and borax as a scrub. And then... You want to wipe off the borax, but keep the castor oil on. And if you're doing this and your skin is drying out, please try Jamaican black castor oil. The stuff is magic. Thank you.